was blind. Duty, respect, selfless service, honor, integrity, and personal courage. We are gathered here in your presence to give thanks for the gift of marriage. We give you honor, glory, and thanksgiving. Holy Spirit, reveal to us the unending love of our Father through the name of Jesus, His Son. Father, you made this happen. It is all your grace and perfect plan. Receive our praises. Lead us, guide us, and bless this time. Let us see your countenance today. In Jesus' name, amen. But honestly, I've never met anyone so like kind, so compassionate, so thoughtful. And during our time, um, even worship, her thoughts are always in my prayer. So like, honestly, like I've never met anyone like you. So I am honored to be your uh, maid of honor. Uh, we're friends I since, uh, since 2011. Uh, after I got back from uh, Afghanistan. So um, we've been knowing each other for like almost nine years. Yeah, all my services have been with him. Has all these values. Meet each other in combat team. So we really can trust each other. Can watch each other's back. Every time I needed help, he was there. You know, everything from transportations to maybe allocating some work. He covered me, he had me all respect. He's always respect me. I, there's not one time that I felt disrespected or had some sort of animosity. True gentleman. Please remember, marriage is a picture of Christ and the church. Marriage is a covenant. It's a covenant agreement, not a contract. Contracts are created by people, but covenants are created by God. Contracts can be broken, but covenants are solemn, sacred, and never-ending. Integrity, always doing the right thing, no matter what it is, even when people are not looking at, at him, he's always doing something right, always. Behind the door, behind the curtains, personal courage. A lot of times he does step up, he step up quite a bit. As you begin your life together, it will be easy to love each other at the beginning. But as time passes, love can fade, and your feelings can sour. But remember, the love of God gave His only begotten Son, Jesus, to be nailed for your sins, and His love never ceases. Grant that the ties which bind Chan and Hannah may continue to grow stronger with the passing years. May they trust each other with perfect confidence and together trust in you for guidance and help in the journey that lies before them. You don't marry the person 
you want to live with. You marry the one you cannot live without. You alone, my confidence. Ready for I pronounce it them to be husband and wife in the name of the Father, Son, and the Holy start. Spirit. Amen.